Guest 3 a the crazy gamer, and welcome back to the Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Link's Awakening. This is part 15, and when we last left off, we just got married. We're heading back to the Animal Village so we can get to uh, the de Yarny Desert, Yarna Desert, so we can get to uh, level 4. Get everything set up for level 4. And the last, the last image that we saw was Link put Marin over his head. He'd probably get a little skirt and peek up the skirt if you know what I mean. But, uh, yeah, I'm just recording. I actually just woke up a lot long ago because I, uh, had to work six hours over. I was supposed to. I was supposed to get off at 5 a.m. I didn't get off to almost 11 because we had some... Uh, people, people when they were make it to work because of, like lack of babysitter or something like that. So we, had, so I had to cover one of their shifts and it got. So I just woke up and I got to be back work in two hours. So I gotta. I'm recording all of this. Anyway, we're heading to that. Uh, we're heading back to that warp to uh, get back to the animal village. Let's see what they say now, down there. Hey. Where are you two going together, huh? Uh, I didn't mean anything, I'm just a kid. Uh-huh. Hey, where are you two going together, huh? I don't know anything, I'm just a kid. We're just kids, too. We're not doing anything in a- Hi, fucking j Chop. Hi, Bell Well. We're not doing anything, uh, inappropriate, I don't think. I would hope not. Of course, in this game you can't really tell that all kind of stuff. He might be, I think mean, Link might be just a kid, but who knows, he might be a young adult by this time. You can't really tell the 8-bit system. Oh, uh, anyway, we made it back to that warp. Hold the warp. Link does. When he closes the warp, he act like he fall down a hole. I don't know if I would technically count it if him falling down a hole or anything like that. Ah! It's her! Little Marin! Yeah, uh, apparently... Little man! Yeah, we all know the, uh... Ah! Is there little man? Yeah, all the animals seem to know who Marin is. Let's go take her to this wars. I think it's down here. So anyway, how y'all gonna have to do today? I mean, so I had a car hop this morning. Oh, there's that wars. Entrance to Yarner Desert! Right! What's, what's this way? Yes. It's that lazy Warris. Shall we give him a little surprise? Uh. If you're thinking what I'm thinking, that, uh, no, I don't want to give him a little surprise. You can, but I'm not. Oh, we're going to sing to him, okay. And the Warris goes, hey, he like bobs his head to the music. He jumps up and down, bobs his head to the music, and he just goes, jump, jump. Jump and flop into the water. <laughs> wow! He certainly woke up with a start. Huh? Oh, he's calling me. It's the same as always. <laughs> Link, I'm going to the animal village. Please drop by, okay? No, I'm not dropping by. Come back, piece of ass. <laughs> Oh, welcome to the Arna Desert, finally. That's where level fours. We're finally making some advancement here. But uh, yeah, so I car hopped and it was really, 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 really slow. I only made about twenty dollars in tips, but hey, that's twenty dollars I did not have, so I can't complain again. Use that to get me some cigarettes and gas in my car. Annoyance. You're only getting in the way. Oh, so this is like a little. This is the uh, keeper. This is a uh, land mola. And uh, it has the key to the fourth dungeon, so. Very easy. Just flies around like an idiot. And you just kind of dodge him and. And just hit him with the sword. It's one of the easier mini bosses, bosses in the game. The only problem is the only problem you have is uh, actually fucking hitting them. Epic rap battles of history. Ah, uh, that was random. He 
you fall down, uh, you're gonna fall down the hole anyway, but you've got the angler key. That's the key to the fourth dungeon, but I can't remember where the fourth dungeon is, so I guess we'll just look around until we find it. Let's see what this owl says. Sea bears foam, sleep bears dreams, goes in in the same way. Crash! You make no sense, stupid owl. Pokey, another Mario reference. Hi, Pokey. Hi, Pokey. More Mario references. There's so many of them in the game. Fucking chain chomp. I see what this is. What the? You found our secret seashell. If you collect a lot of these, something good's going to happen. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully tonight will go much smoother. I can get off right at 5 o'clock. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a long night if I got to stay past 5. And Link, you're about to die. Because you fucking suck at life. Call yourself the hero. And it's the motherfucking owl! What? The shape of the key shows a fish swimming up a cascade of water. Go now to the mountain waterfall. Leap from the top and you will reach your goal. Alright, if you know where to go now, we gotta go to the mountain water top and... Next time I see you, Al... You are mine. You're not going to interfere with me anymore, stupid Al. Oh, Link, I have to come here to this village to sing too. It seems that just about everyone knows my ballad of the wind fish. Link, what is your favorite song? Uh, definitely not Ballad of the Wind Fish. I would say one of my favorite songs ever would have to be, uh, uh, Freak on the Leash by Korn. Yeah, I'm a huge Korn fan. Korn's my favorite band ever. I'm really big into heavy metal and metal and rock and death metal and any kind of metal, metal, rock, metal, metal, metal. Basically, anything that rocks my ass off, I, I like. Um, Azalea Dying, Corn, Chop for a Cowboy, Slipknot, Mushroom Head, Mud Vein, uh, Cradle of Filth, Winds of Plague, you know, uh, Goat Whore. Yeah, there's actually a band called Goat Whore. I don't know if anybody's ever heard of them before, but there's actually a band called Goat Whore. You've got a piece of the force! You can feel the force flowing through you! Alright, so we gotta find our way to the uh, mountain, uh, waterfall. The problem is I have no idea how to get there. I guess we'll just continue heading north as much as we can until we find it. Ooh, fairy. Let's heal your wounds and get you hypnotized and make you do bad things. No! Go away, stupid fairy! Okay. I uh, don't remember how I linked into daily falling down a hole for today. I don't know how to get to the waterfall. We'll find it out, though. Maybe it's this way. Brains! 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 Zip away, stupid zombies. Uh, okay. I think I'm going the right way. We'll just continue he Hey, it's Crazy Tracy. Uh, no, we're just gonna stay away from you as far as possible. Fucking Crazy Tracy. Pouring your secret juice all over me. Uh, but we said you had it. Tall, tall heights. I think this is where I was supposed to go. This is the mountain area, so we're just gonna continue heading north until we find some kind of waterfall. Okay. I think I'm finally heading the right direction here. Tamara Mountain. Tamaranch Mountain. Go Ponga Swamp. Yeah, we don't, go, we don't need to go back to Kaponga Swamp. That's where we fuck, said fucking Chain Chomp to uh, get to level 2. Let's continue. Oh, the windfish sleeps long and dreamily in the egg above. 
When you play the eight siren instruments in front of the egg, he will awaken. This, my friend, is the only way for you to leave the island. Ooh. Uh. Mount Tamarant. Uh. Yeah. So that's where the windfish is at. And. You escaped from my grasp, Mr. Mr. Uh, Owl. Ah, I think I found it. I think this is the way I'm supposed to go. So anyway, guys, yeah, I gotta work. Night shift tonight. I mean, over, overnight again tonight. Hopefully, it won't be too bad. I'm, when I get to, before I head to work, I'm probably probably going to stop and get me a. Uh, And the earthquake happens, and a secret passage reveals to be level four. No, okay, there's the entrance level four, but the problem is, how do I get there? There's an entrance somewhere around here. Oh, there's another uh, warp spot. How do we get to level four? Ah, I like like likey 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 likey. Come back here, like like. Uh, okay, we're going down this little path here. Sorry, my roommate trying to enter the room again. Okay, I don't think that's the right way because I can't get through there. Okay, I am hopelessly lost of how to get actually to the. Wait a minute! Didn't it say to go from above? So I gotta find some way to get above there and fall down. Once I once I get to, uh, to the entrance level four and actually enter level four, we will uh, end it here. But I gotta figure out how to get up there to the top first. You got a guardian acorn, yay! Okay, so I remember now. He said to go north uh, above, but the problem is, is I can't remember how to go above. I gotta figure that out. We'll figure it out. But, uh, yeah, just destroying some moblins, trying to get to the entrance level four. Once I enter level four, we will call it a video. My cock is much bigger than yours. Uh, okay. Maybe this is the way to go. Keys and little bitty bouncy thingies. Alright. Sorry I'm being so quiet. I got nothing to say right now. Uh, but, yeah, um, I think I made about $20. So I used it. There's a heart piece I can get to. There's a chest I can get to. I can get to this chest. You've got 50 rupees! Very nice! Wait a minute. Uh, yeah, like I said, I'm still sort of waking up, so it's just kind of bleh. Uh, there's next part, one part of the trading sequence. There's a hibiscus flower. Aha! Level 4! We're gonna end the video here. Level 4, English Tunnel. We're gonna end the video here. When we come back, we're gonna start to explore the level 4 dungeon and uh, see what we have in here. And I think we get the flippers in this area, which would be good. Anyway, we're gonna sign off here. This is BKS3 and the Crazy Gamer signing out.